Hey guys, we are out here at St. Augustine, Florida. This uh, particular area was founded in 1565 and it's got a whole lot of history. We have some family friends here from California, so we brought them out here to St. Augustine. So I figured I would share this with you. I've been here a few times and it's jam packed full of history. Now our plans are is to go down to the old fort, now which was a real fort, supposed to be all uh, haunted and all that kind of stuff like that. So anyway, we're gonna get down there and then I'm gonna get some footage of what we're doing here today. So we'll be back in a bit. We are out here at Castillo de San Marcos Fort, and it was actually founded in 1565, and it is the oldest actual structure in all of San Augustine. It was uh, put up as Ponce de Leon came in here in the uh, 1560, something like that, and then brought a whole bunch of people in 1565, which colonated the whole San Augustine area. Now, what we're looking at here is one of their storage areas and it's naturally cool in here and it's because of the thickness of these walls man this is crazy take a look at this what you're looking at here guys is a standard area for billeting for an officer this is the officer's quarters and uh, you can see the stair steps that go up to the uh, gun section up here this is just so cool now there is no natural air condition in this place. Just think how it would be in the summertime uh, with 100% humidity out here. I would want nothing to do with that. You got date stuff up here, 1883. If you can see right here, Alex Carter. And that was 1883. He even had graffiti back then. <laughs> is a guard tower and this is where they would stand sentry looking for uh, invading ships coming into the port really cool
as hell, and that's not a 360 shot. <laughs> Just standard barracks of fruits. Now this here, guys, is what they use for a hot shot. They would actually heat the cannonballs to red hot. And then that would be shot to an enemy ship to set, set the ship on fire. Interesting stuff. Look at the inside of that. That's kind of cool. Wow. Guys, did you know that uh, the movie G.I. Joe uh, was actually shot here when they did the landing to take out the uh, the phony president and all that kind of stuff. Well, the landing and all that attack was right on this drawbridge and inside the fort. And then the landing of uh, Dwayne Johnson's uh, tank was actually on that point over here, and it was really cool. Anyway, we're going to continue our walk. We've already walked around the full perimeter. And it's been really, really cool. So, hey, we'll be back in a bit. Now, this is the multi-use moat. Now, the reason they called it that is also the area that they kept their pigs, cattle, uh, you know, barn animals, food, and stuff like that. They kept them in the multi-use moat. This is really a cool place. Well, guys, this is supposed to be haunted. This area here, we're talking to some people that go tours and this particular place. So they're saying to look into the dormer windows up there and over here and see if we can see anything. I don't see nothing. Anyway. <laughs> we were down here <laughs> in Old Town, San Augustine, having us a blast. Went and had lunch at this really cool place, pigged out with some Rubens and all that kind of thing. Uh, did our trek out the there. Teeny Martini. Is that what it was? Yeah. Teeny Martini. Anyway, we did that and we went up to the, uh, the uh, what's the name of that? The that fort. Big old fort and did some tours around there. It was actually awesome. So anyway, guys, hey, we're going to wrap this thing up out here. We hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you on the next one. <laughs>